finally, if you have a GPS in your car, chances are you've already spent hours with a woman you're about to meet. Continue 1.3 miles, then bear left on Broadway. She is that dashboard companion guiding us when we're lost. Recalculating. Who exactly is that mystery lady in your GPS? At the red light, please stop. Mystery solved. This is Karen Jacobson, also known as GPS Karen on those car navigation systems. <laughs> Turn left on Broadway. She's very insistent, isn't she? She is. You're not the only woman in my life who tells me where to go, by the way. Oh, oh, oh dear. <laughs> Um, but I don't talk back. <laughs> <laughs> sometimes, you, sometimes you do. Karen just opened her own cabaret show in New York City. Turns out she's actually an accomplished singer who's recorded several CDs. I grew up wanting to sing and thinking my voice was going to come out of the car radio. And here I am talking to people, giving directions in the GPS. It's a complete surprise to me. Even oh, as she now. maps out this new hard. career, don't worry, that Your familiar voice will still be there. Recalculating. <laughs> blaring from the dashboard. Only now, you'll be able to picture the mystery woman who's along for the ride. Continue straight ahead. <laughs> you are on the right road, Jeremy. <laughs> Jeremy Hubbard, ABC News, New York. Welcome back to The Early Show. It is now 746. She's the voice that guides you and soothes you and makes sure that you get to that special destination without getting lost. Australian English Karen. Meet Karen Jacobson, the GPS lady or Australian Karen. And right on West 57th Street. She was chosen for her calming accent, guiding drivers around the world. Recalculating. Right now, up to 25 million people are listening to me give them directions no. around the world. How does that feel? Awesome. <laughs> I feel very popular. I always wanted to be popular. <laughs> and those 25 million fans may not know her by face, but her voice is instantly recognizable. You have reached your destination. Oh my God, it's you. <laughs> She's even launched a music career. The questions never seem to end. Some fans have navigated their way to her music online. No matter what, her voice will still be the one most used to find their way home. Turn left on 8th Avenue. Michelle Miller, CBS News, New York. I love you.